Hello, in this video I'm going to show you how to connect up a PlayStation Classic controller up to your Linux machine so you can use it on the PC SX2 emulator to play PlayStation 2 games. So let me show you the controller right now. So it's one of the controllers that comes with your PlayStation Classic. It is wired only so you need you know, a spare USB port to no wireless option. So it's really simple, it's just literally plug and play. So let me grab this, let me plug it in, I've got like a little hub here, okay, that's all plugged in now. Now we just need to actually map this on PCSX2, so open that up, make sure this is closed when you connect it, because it doesn't always recognize a new controller added, and that's not like a PlayStation Classic controller issue, it's just a general issue, yeah. and if it was open, you can just close it and reopen it. Go to controller, plugin settings, and there we go, it's detected the extra controller. Go to clear. What you may notice is it doesn't have analog sticks because that's the because that the reason for that is the original PlayStation 1 controller didn't have them. So if you are playing a game that requires analog sticks and requires the other button as well, then you're out to look, or because it does support mapping on the keyboard and mouse as well, so you can do a combo between this, your keyboard, and your mouse. But I'm just going to do this the best that I can, basically without the analog sticks. I'm going to be playing Tekken 4 to demonstrate, and that doesn't require analog sticks. So let's get started. So let's start mapping this side. Just click on it and start mapping. And that's the analog stick. Let's do R1 and R2. Let's do new start. Let me switch over. Let me just select while I'm here. Up, left, down, and right. Finally, L1 and L2. So if I click enable force feedback, this does not have force feedback because the original PlayStation did not have force feedback. So that doesn't do anything. So you just want to go to OK. And now that's it, so you're all good to go to run your game. Let me just show you it working. I've got Tekken 4 selected. I want to go to Fast Boot. Let's lay load up. And I'll get to the menu by pressing these two buttons. Okay, so I'll just turn the volume very low. And as you can see, it is working. Let me get into a one match. Let me do random pull. Okay. And then let me beat the computer. And then we're done. Look at that hair on Paul. Looks like a surfer here. Oh, that is. Yeah. Okay, so that's him done. Let me pause it when I get into the game. There we go. So that is how you connect up your PlayStation Classic controller. It's literally plug and play. And the only extra sort of configuration you need to do is in within PCSX2. So that's it. If you have any questions, feel free to pop me a message. And as usual, I look forward to seeing you in the next video.